All right, guys. I think we are live. Uh, just want to say Happy New Year to uh, all of you. And um, uh, give us some, some, uh, some basic news here. Um, as some of you know, uh, Sherilyn and I have been uh, goofing around on Facebook for, uh, for quite a while. Um, having some fun doing some, uh, some live videos over the last, uh, couple of months. And one of the things that, uh, we've had discussions about is, um, the reach of some of these videos that we've shot. Um, and we've been just kind of surprised at how many people tune in and watch, watch some of our, our videos that we have filmed and had, uh, so much fun doing so over the last couple of months. So I, you know, I, I got talking with Sherilyn and a, and a few close friends and I said, you know, I think in 2019, I might act on something that I have been thinking about now for quite some time. You know, um, some of you might know that I've been thinking about writing a book called Aired Out uh, about what's been going on in real life uh, off the air. Um, and a lot has happened over the last couple of years, um, good and, and not so good, as uh, I'm sure so many of you can can relate to. Um, you know, we go through uh, we go through years in our life where not much happens, and then we go through uh, maybe, I guess, a growth spurts where a lot of things happen in a short period of time. Uh, that's been the case for the last two years for for Sherilyn and I, um, and for me on a on a separate level. Um, a lot of uh, a lot of uh, personal stuff. Um, so, in instead of uh, writing this book called "Aired Out" to kind of share, um, just. Uh, stuff about life and, and stuff that, that I've been going through and um, can connect with so many people on, on so many different levels. I decided um, that a podcast would be a much faster way to get it all out. Uh, the good, the bad, the personal stories that I'm really not able to approach much on uh, terrestrial radio. Um, so I'm starting up a podcast that's that's actually already started. Uh, kind of a, um, I had someone tell me, oh, it's a it's a it's a soft launch, and uh, the way I look at it is more of a of a soft landing. Um, so I've already got a couple under my belt here, and I'm I'm very excited about my partnership with Central Vermont Television, uh, Tony Campos, and. Alex and Abubakar and a few other folks over there that are uh, making this possible. And I'm going to, to uh, put a lot more time and effort into this podcast. Right now, it's going to be weekly here on YouTube on my channel called Aired Out. Um, but I want to invite others to... to be a part of this podcast. Um, this is totally, totally different kind of broadcasting than than I've done in in radio. It's um, it's all talk. It's going to be uh, it, at least for now a full hour once a week, and hopefully uh, grow from there. Um, I'm already booked with guests into February at this point, and looking to expand that, but I want to, um, 
use this platform as an opportunity to connect more with community, with the arts, with folks that are fundraising, um, have great events going on that need some help with publicity. Um, I want to have a business spotlight. I want to have a nonprofit spotlight. Um, I'd love to have a small town hero segment at some point, but I also want to kind of incorporate a lot of what I've done in radio, in morning radio over the years. I want to have some uh, entertainment news in there. Um, I want to have some fun. I want to tell you, of course, about weather and sports and and have uh, have that information on there and, and Vermont news. I'm going to kind of try to stay away from um, – politics for the most part. I'll brush on them every now and then, but um, I'd love to give folks a break from from politics, even local politics, and just um, just focus on what's going on in our backyard, uh, but also tell you a little bit more about me um, and the last couple of years of, of my life. Uh, I have quite quite a story to share, and I've shared it with people uh, face to face that I've I've known and that I've met um, that can relate and have gone through similar experiences. We have, gosh, we have so many uh, similar stories to to share. Um, so this this new podcast is called Aired Out. Uh, there there really won't be much if anything that i'm going to hold back on and at times i know that i'm going to be uh, out of my comfort zone and uh it's a different experience than than radio um but as i as i said over the last couple of months of viewership of some of these videos that we've posted on facebook have a shocked Sherilyn and I, with how many people have have watched, um, you know, we, almost two thousand people saw the inside of my fridge <laughs> in just a few hours uh, a couple of weeks ago, and that just reaffirmed the profound message that it, a podcast is the direction that I should go into. So um, that is. Uh, that's kind of the news in a nutshell. Um, it's very easy to subscribe to my YouTube channel. All you have to do is get on youtube.com and in the search bar, you type in aired out, aired out. Uh, you'll see a red icon uh, with white letters that says aired out. That's the channel right there. You can click subscribe and Right now, you're going to see uh, a, a couple of uh, recent shows that I that I did. One with Mike Pelcher from Camp Mead, uh, who had an incredible event this past Saturday night. And uh, just prior to that, uh, my annual DUI DWI show with Sergeant Barito from the Orange County uh, Sheriff's Department, um, talking about uh, drinking and driving uh, and, and just being safe through the whole year, but especially New Year's weekend. This is uh, some, something that I've been, that message I've been pushing on the air now for almost 20 years. Uh, but to bring it to a podcast where um, I'm not rushed because of the music, I'm not rushed because of commercials, and I can get more into the nitty gritty, into the meat of the message that I would like to get out, um, which is, again, something that I've been wanting to do for a long time. And then, um, you know, over the last couple of months, especially Sherilyn and I were, were just, uh, you know, we've talked about this and we're like, you know, this is a no brainer. A podcast is, is maybe something that I should have started up a long time ago. So, I'm going to go for it. Um, I've already started to go for it. I actually already have a couple of presenting sponsors, uh, Fontaine Forestry and Millworks in East Montpelier, uh, Peak Entertainment, 
out of Stowe and Morrisville, uh, Newton Wells and Company, and CBD Crave. I don't know if you've ever heard of these guys, uh, but they are amazing. I know there's uh, a lot of CBD companies uh, that are sprouting up across the Northeast. These guys are unbelievable. Their website, cbdcrave.com, is something you, you ought to check out. Um, the next podcast that I do, I'm actually going to be um, offering you a discount on cbdcrave.com for a full week, um, but I'm not going to uh, do that until I go on with the next podcast. So um, there's a lot more that I obviously have to share with you and tell you about this uh, this new YouTube channel, this new podcast aired out, um, and I will be as as time goes on here in the in the coming weeks. But 2019 is I is a year that I have just got to make some changes and do this. I've got to do this podcast. It's something that um, it, it's, it's just been calling to me um, for a long time now. I'll, I'll wake up in the morning and within seconds, my mind is... Uh, is absorbed in the the thought of a podcast and who I can interview and what businesses would be so cool to to be featured. Um, it's not really a television show; it's a podcast. It's a I, I think of it as a um, a videotaped radio show. It's also going to be broadcast on public access channel one ninety two and one ninety four uh, locally in Barrie. Uh, CVTV, Central Vermont Television, Video Vision, uh, Tony Campos, and the rest of the guys over there. Uh, we're, we're real excited to be working together. And literally, I have a, a paper list that I'm making as, as I'm in my car. I'm finding myself uh, scribbling down uh, on, the, on the seat next to me who I would like to come on the air with me. Um, I'm excited about Vast coming on real soon. Um, a whole bunch of musicians, uh, Chad Hollister, Dave Keller, um, and a, just a long list, a long list of musicians that uh, are going to be on the show. Uh, and also artists, uh, other types of artists, uh, not just music. Um, so I got some really exciting things on the on the horizon here. Uh, this is uh, kind of a um, a work in progress for for a while here. It's uh, it may be a little bumpy. Um, this is a whole new experience for me doing a podcast, but it's it's something that uh, um, I will come to you and seek your advice, your suggestions, uh, whether it be an interview or whether it be a, a message that uh, should be put out to everybody uh, publicly. So um, I want to take this platform. I want to share it with you. I want you to be part of it. Um, I want to interview some really interesting people. The movers and the shakers, the Vermonters that really know how to get stuff done. Uh, there are so many remarkable events that go on in our community that deserve a lot more recognition than they get. There's nonprofit organizations that just should be more uncovered, more exposed, more supported, uh, better known, and have the, the right to be more successful and should be more successful. And I'm gonna see if I can help them out but also shine the spotlight on some some great area businesses too that are just so amazing that if you've never been to, um, such as Camp Mead over on Route 2, Exit 9, Middlesex, uh, places like that, The Hive and um, Red Hen Bakery, and uh, just what a great spot, what a great spot. So I'm so excited to have you, you guys tune in 
watch my YouTube channel, but also I'm excited to invite you to come on to it, to sit next to me, to share your story. If you know a great story or cool business or an event that's coming up um, this winter or this spring, uh, tell me about it. Uh, you can email me at beyondthedog97 at gmail.com. You can also Facebook me. You can also post messages right here on my YouTube channel. Uh, make sure to like it. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, comment below if you can. Um, but again, if you're watching on Facebook right now, uh, get over to my YouTube channel. It's called Aired Out. Aired Out. A I R E D. Out. Aired Out. Um, tell me what your ideas are, your thoughts. And again, if you're watching on Facebook, I'm directing you to head on over to YouTube and find my YouTube channel aired out. That is, uh, where this podcast already exists. Got two shows in there and many more coming down the pipe here in 2019. So, uh, that's it for now. Um, Again, I'm looking for any kinds of uh, any kind of uh, suggestions or ideas on uh, some great interviews coming up in the year. I'm already booked right now into well into February, but um, I'm lining them up. I'm lining them up, and I'm hoping that this will have a great impact. I'm hoping that uh, you're going to learn a lot more about me, and I'm going to learn a lot more about you and the similar stories maybe that we have shared together. I've had some experiences over the last couple of years uh, that a lot of you don't know about, um, you might relate to, um, but they're, um, they're stories that um, I may not know right off the top of my head how to approach or how to tell, um, but I'm going to I'm going to attempt to do that. Um, and to be honest with you, um, it's going to require an awful lot of courage on my part to to be able to do that. Um, so um, I'm hoping that uh, that you'll be part of that. Um, there's a lot of stuff to air out. And as I said at the beginning of this video, there's good and there's not so good. And mostly, I think it's going to be good. And I think it's going to be great. And I look forward to having you all part of it. Thank you. Happy New Year. Please be safe tonight. Um, if, if you're out, please don't drink and drive. And if you're drinking, have, have a designated driver or just pack a pack a sleeping bag and stay put, all right? Uh, remember, there's a lot of people that love you, and uh, we just want you to get through the night, okay? It's not worth drinking and driving. Anyway, I'm going to get off that soapbox. Uh, I'm going to let you go for now. Thank you all again so much for your friendship and your support. Uh, going forward with this uh, this new endeavor and uh, God bless.